Hey guys, it's your girl, Miss Kimberly J. Uh, my next public service announcement for today is about hygiene. I, I really, it really hurts me that I have to do a video like this, but I feel like it's just time to clear the air and, and just put it out there. Um, I see this not going on. Wow. Um, now, I, I'm going to be honest, and I hope that I don't offend anybody with what I'm about to say on this video, but once again I feel like it needs to be said sadly because not everybody has gotten this memo as well um, I am an American you know I was born and raised in the United States of America cool with it I have friends of all different races ethnicities um, nationalities that come from all over you know they're not just from here from different countries I'm cool with people I don't have an issue. You know, I'm not uh, prejudiced, racist, or anything like that. However, I do feel it necessary to say, and this applies to anybody, I don't care what race or, or you are, um, cleanliness to me is next to godliness. <laughs> and it's sad that, you know, like, I feel like unless you have a nose problem or you can't smell, you don't have a sense of smell, you should always be aware of your hygiene. You should always know if you're fresh or not. Um, and it shouldn't take someone telling you or you know, you, t you open your mouth to speak and people back away or they're like, what the heck, what was that? You know, like, don't you smell? I always, I'm always curious to people who have like bad hygiene and bad breath. How do you not know? Like they act like they don't know um that their breath is tore up and, or that they funky you know like they need to shower they didn't use deodorant properly and the worst thing in the world i've ever heard of and seen is people who don't bathe properly and have the nerve to spray cologne or perfume on top of that funk i don't get it i don't understand it it's disgusting and, and that is a major turn off for me I, I can't even it's just hard for me to even be around people I'm serious I'm not talking about if you somebody on the streets poor and they you know they don't have access to it I'm talking about regular people who work who have access to um, water and soap and they don't use it for whatever reason or if they are doing that but the breath is just completely tore up and I'm kinda like is there a medical condition do you have some dental issues that need to get worked out you know I don't understand how you're not aware that your breath stink. I mean, if my breath stinks, I would know it stinks. You know, um, I would know if I'm funky. You'll know when you smell. Like, can't you smell yourself? I, I got, just want somebody to answer that for me because I'm really, really baffled. I feel like I don't really care where you come from. I don't care what your, what country you come from, what family you come from, what culture you come from. I feel like washing your behind should be a universal um, language. <laughs> I just feel like. It, it should it should be no exceptions to the rule on that and maybe that sounds mean and harsh because people have different um cultures or you know religious backgrounds or whatever and some say well it's against my religion i'm like i i don't know i'm just saying i just don't think god wants you to be funky i i, I mean we got soap we have so many things that you can do to rectify that problem you should never be like that just walking around like how do you i don't understand like how you wake up got dressed came out your house and your breath was jacked up like in the morning before anything even went on how are you funky in the morning before you even do anything to get funky throughout the day like all i'm saying is take a bath and brush your teeth and, and keep your hygiene up like i'm a big stickler for cleanliness i i love to to smell good i love for everything on me to smell good and i do have a bit of a uh <laughs> I do have a, a slight addiction to uh, Bath and Body Works fragrances. I, I'm just, for those who are into Bath and Body Works, Twilight Woods. That's all I'm going to say, ladies. It's Twilight Woods. It, it's a beautiful thing. Anywho, that's what I want to say. So, just take a bath, a shower, a brush your teeth, floss, you know, gargle. Do what you have to do, but keep your hygiene tight. You know, it's it's a big turnoff. I mean, I can I think I can attest to it. Um, speak on behalf of, of a lot of women. If a man walk up to me and his breath is jacked up, or he's funky, that X's you right off the list. And I'm pretty sure I don't think a man likes a woman 
that's funky and, and has jacked up breath to it. It's just, it's no excuse for it. That's all I'm saying. It's too many ways to get clean. So, you know, send this out to your community. <laughs> Take a bath, y'all. Brush your teeth. You know, do the things that you're supposed to be doing growing up that mom and daddy taught you how to do or whoever raised you taught you how to do. Just do it. You know, like, <sighs> I feel bad that I even had to say that, but hey, sometimes you got to just put you out there. Alrighty. Y'all let me know what you think.